want to be quiet. He wasn't quiet when I walked through the door. I didn't say nothing to you when you walked through. What's up y'all what's up welcome back welcome back so i'm actually on my way to um get a b12 injection um i found this place and they're giving out well you get for whew, for new patients you get a free injection for your first visit my appointment's like in 20 minutes but i'm trying to figure out what to wear so i have on this top that i got from zara's some mom jeans i believe from zara's y'all know i got this belt from a flea market but i don't know excuse the mess in here i don't know if i like these shoes with it i just want to put on something comfy and i don't want to have to put on like sneakers or something like that not with this outfit and i'm definitely not putting on heels so let me go figure it out. Okay, y'all, I decided to wear these slides. My mom got me these like two Christmases ago. But um, I think that these are just simple, cute, run in there and run out. It's only like a 20-minute appointment. So I will see y'all when I get there. I'm scared, y'all. I always do this. I will make an appointment for something that I know is going to hurt. But I've been wanting to get these little um, IV transfusions for a minute. And I was reading on their website that they do iron transfusions, which if you don't know, I, my iron levels are completely washed out. They're super low, so I'm going to get information on that. But I hate needles, y'all. And my veins in my arms, they always say the nurses, oh, they're so tiny. So, uh, I just, I used to not even like trip off of needles, but for whatever reason now, I've just been tripping off the of needles. Like not a big deal, but just like, oh, uh, uh, so hopefully she can find my vein because as I'm looking, I don't see not a damn vein in my arm. I'm not going to let her do it in my hand because they do try to find them in my hand, but that hurts. But um, anyway, I'm going to go in here now because I'm pretty sure I got to fill out paperwork. So see y'all in there. I know I done said that about three times. Ooh, I don't know why I have this fear of needles all of a sudden. <laughs> it used to not be like really that. It's really thin, the needle. So it's a real quick poke. You won't feel it too much. Okay. Um, and then we go in the bottom here because it's a bigger muscle. Oh, yeah. I didn't know that. So it's a booty shot. It is. Oh, gosh. <laughs> it's just mad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. I didn't know that. I thought it was through the arm. No, oh my yeah. God. So the IVs, again, we'll do the IVs. Like those needles go into usually your. AC veins here because they're a little bit bigger. Yes. Um, but then the muscle here, here, yeah, the muscle there is a little bit bigger. Uh -huh. So, oh my god, it's a little I'm more safe my that old way. Rolls and everything. <laughs> <laughs> You're fine. Oh. Yeah, this is easy now because I got a bunch of fat here. <laughs> Oh, that's fine. When we get to the muscle, that's all right. I'm going to have you shift your weight so all your weight is on this leg. Okay. Perfect. Ooh. So, will it? All right. You're going to feel me squeeze, okay. squeeze. One, two, three. That was the injection. That's it? That's it. That's all that fat. <laughs> all right. You're not bleeding. Do you want a band-aid? No. Okay. You're all wow. Set. Okay. Yeah. I can get those every day. That wasn't too bad, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> now I feel like I'm gonna do something else, but I have to make an appointment, huh? Yeah. Well, so I mean, if you're, I mean, you're already here. An so actual... we do like walk-ins too. You okay. don't necessarily always need. Sometimes it gets busy, so with walk-ins, like you might be waiting a little longer. Mm -hmm. But if you wanted to get an IV, 
How much? How long do they take? About thirty to forty-five minutes, depending on how quickly the fluids run in. I I like that happy shot. I need that. So um, happy shot is B twelve uh -huh. and B six. Can I get more? You you can. Okay. Um, the only caveat would be I think you'd be getting like double dose on B twelve. Okay. Which should be fine as long as you don't have any kind of sensitivity to B twelve. Sometimes people will report that. And make I've them had the pills, and sometimes it can be a little like caffeine, right? The way caffeine. Or I don't usually get like the jittery feel from it, but people will ha tell me that they are unable to sleep at nighttime. Oh, really? <laughs> from it? Yeah. And then you usually we just make sure that they don't get too much, and they get it early in the morning. Okay. I don't call it coffee. I just call it love. It took two and a half hours because for whatever reason, so I went in there like I told y'all to do the B12. I thought that was through an um, IV and it's not. It's actually just a shot that, as y'all saw in my behind, but then I'm like, well, I wanted to do a transfusion. So I got the happy one where it like transmits off happy um, before I even say it jack it all up so I got the happy shot which it produces uh, more happy neurotransmitters like serotonin and dopamine okay and then she put some more vitamins in there but it was like people going in and coming out and like their bags were emptying in like 25 minutes and mine literally took two hours. I'm like, oh my God. And so she tried to poke me in my hand. The vein was like, hell no, <laughs> you are not poking in the hand. So I had to just sit there and uh, I am not a patient person, I must admit. So I had to literally just sit there and be patient and wait for it to finish. Bobby calling me, cause we got Best Buy at the house. They're putting in speakers and all this other crap that he wanted, but he has an attitude with me because I'm not there. <sighs> anyway, so I'm on my way back home. Um, hopefully I can feel the effects of this B12 and all the, the B12 shot was free for um, new patients, but, um, and she gave me 15% off because I had to sit there and wait. So I'm like, okay, cool whatever but next time i know that my vein just does not take in fluids quickly so i just have to make sure that i make time um for it to for it to go through but they were really really nice in there it's very clean it's very quiet um a lot of people are not in and out of there they're based in pasadena but boy my vein was tripping and then as you can see, she had to bandage me up where she did my hand because yeah, <laughs> my hand was not having it. But anyway, y'all, I'm gonna get through this traffic so I can go home and he can get on my damn nerves. So I'll see you in a minute. 
and she ain't even look yeah you better say thank you sweetie you guys, i just looked at my receipt and i got the hydration refresh so basically this is great for me um because this basically replenishes your body it's good for stress management and it says unlocking your athletic potential because it quickly puts those um puts that water those fluids back into your system and for me y'all i do not drink a lot of water so this right here is super great for me to stay hydrated it's super hot out here so i'm glad i got this i wasn't too sure what exactly i got i was able to look on the receipt and it was there so I, again it's called the hydration refresh and this place they're called Hydration Room. I'm not sure if I got a shot of the sign, but they also offer m memberships so that you can go in because she said there's people that go in there twice a week, once a week. And with the monthly membership, you just go in there and get your injections or whatever. So I like it. I actually feel very alert and up and alive. So we'll see as the days go by. New Jersey, there is a mall that my wife likes to frequent. Uh, she used to frequent often, not as much anymore, and that is Short Hill Mall. Angela Yee, you're a uh, frequent yes, uh, I am. visitor of Short Hills Mall. How, just there how would you non describe Short Hills Mall? Is it high end? Yeah, it's very high-end. It has a demon market. Yeah. Yeah. Now, they got the Herm store, Herm and Louis Vuitton. The Herm and Louis Vuitton. The channel. We are on this truck. We are on our way to get some tacos from Guisados. If you have Guisados in your area, they have really good small tacos. You hungry? You looking for a taco? I got two. Did you want a tamale? Because I got two chicken tamales too. Because now they have chicken tamales on their menu. So I got to make sure I ask for that green verde sauce because they won't give it to you if you don't ask. So, yep, it's the end of the day. Today's Tuesday. Had a long day with the Best Buy people. Babe was mad at me because I wasn't there. Were you mad? <laughs> now he want to be quiet. He wasn't quiet when I walked through the door. Oh, because you was just waiting to, for your turn to be able to. Wait. So these are the tacos, y'all. I got three shrimp, and these are to die for. I really, really love this place. Um, again, it's called Guisado. So, yep, that's dinner. And I'm pretty much going to relax the rest of the day. I had to do a whole bunch of training for work that's boring and long um, because it was overdue. So, Today, I'm pretty much just going to chill. I got some shows I need to catch up on. If y'all are watching The Shy, let me know how you like it. I'm really feeling The Shy. Um, but there's a couple other shows that I need to catch up on that I didn't watch over the weekend. But yep, that's it. I was going to get my car serviced. And I had to cancel that appointment because they had no loaners. So I guess I'll be going next Thursday, so next week, to um, get my car serviced. So tomorrow I'm not going to do much. The Best Buy people are coming back to finish our speakers for the backyard. So I'm pretty much going to probably be here all day while they're here. And then, of course, as always, y'all know I got a Amazon or some type of unboxing for you. But, yeah, I have an Amazon um, unboxing that I want to do with y'all. And a couple other things I want to show y'all tomorrow. This vlog is probably going to be a little shorter than usual. Um, but that's all right. You know, I like variety, you know, short, long, and see what you guys like. That's what I'm trying to figure out. Do you like the longer vlogs or do you like the um, the shorter vlogs? So anyway, my memory card, these 4K memory cards are crazy. Like, I 
I film a few clips and it's already saying there's no memory so, there. I am. You know what? Before we even get into this, I am going to stop saying y'all. Like it, it makes me cringe at how much I say y'all. So we are going to practice in my videos, me not saying that word as much, as much. But I'm shooketh. <laughs> I am shocked because um, today when I went to the IV, um, and it's not transfusion, it's called IV therapy. When I went there today, um, my trans... See, I can say my, well, my IV had B6 in it. So I decided to look up all of the um, benefits of taking vitamin B6. And one of them is it prevents and treats anemia by aiding hemoglobin production. Like I am so happy because that is like one of my main symptoms that I have is being anemic from the fibroids and my hemoglobin is super, super low. So this is my new place. Like I also research how often you should go and it says that you should go and get the IV therapies at least um, every two to three weeks. And then once your body gets used to it and once you start feeling like better, um, then you just start going once a month to keep it up. So I am super excited because I had no clue that B6 did that. So I think that I'm going to try that instead of the iron pills and I'm going to go, I'm going to go every, I'm going to go every three weeks for, uh, uh, well, I'm going to go one more time in another three weeks and get something else that does include B6 and then I'm going to see how I feel. But I'm excited. I really, really like that place. And I think that it is important, y'all, to not just pop medications that the doctor prescribes to you and think that that's the only way to help your health and, and improve your health because there's so many like different ways to go about having great health and feeling good. So you're going to see on my channel, like I, tr I love natural ways to feel good and to look good. And I'm not about popping pills and doing all this stuff that's really hurting your health. So I thought I would just tell you guys that. So I will see y'all tomorrow. If I let this go, you can tell me about it. I'm talking about your body. I hope you're responsible. I'm not just here to buy. If I let this go, you can tell me about it. I'm talking about your body. I hope you're responsible. Killing me. And again, look at this, no gym, no fitness trainer, but she kicked my ass. She's new, I guess, Kelly, and I cannot think of her husband. They getting tired of working out. They've been doing fitness blender for decades, so I don't blame them for getting her. She's really good. I gotta know that when I do her workouts though, she's gonna kick my butt. So, yep, workout complete, as y'all can see. I am drenched. Look at my shirt. So I'm about to hop in the shower. Okay, so we got some music installed. Um, like I was telling y'all 
probably yesterday, Best Buy came by and they installed these speakers in our backyard and they're outdoor speakers. Hopefully y'all can see that because the sun is beaming. This big one right here is going to go like underground, but our landscaper has to do that. But these little speakers will remain out. So now we can bust down the block. So let me play it so y'all can hear if I know what I'm doing. So first of all, the speakers and everything are coming through an app called Savant. Y'all probably can't even see my phone, so I'm not even going to show you, but I'm going to play the music. Let's see. I'm going to play something, any old thing. And y'all hear that? Look at the little lizard there. He feeling it. Look at him. Look at him. He is feeling it. Let me turn it up and see if he going to feel it. Look at him. <laughs> you like it what you see? Everything just kind of that's on me. Loud. It goes louder than that. So, yeah, that's that. And then we also got these speakers that go on each side. So, if we want to listen to the music from here, we can. And then, of course, we working on a pool right here. This is the perfect area. Look at all this grass space. And we'll be in there. And then, of course, they have to come back um, in a few weeks or so and put some more speakers way down there. And then we'll be done. So, yep. And then in here, I used to have to watch my Apple TV. Them speakers get loud. And I'm... Out here, the, what, landscape, uh, and wait till they put them other speakers in that ain't here yet. <laughs> um, but I used to have to. I put my Apple TV here in the court. Used to go from here to the TV. All of that has been centralized into here, and then you can either use this digital remote, which costs a million dollars, or everything is programmed on your phone. So, yep, they just left, so I'm about to get in here and clean up because it's dusty where they've been coming in and out of the backyard. And then, as always, I have some unboxing for y'all, so I'll be back. Finally, I'm um, opening up this Amazon box, and this box is huge, so I'm praying that those acrylic drawers that I told y'all about fit. Or I keep saying drawers, acrylic containers for my drawer in this bathroom. I don't know. I did the measurements, but let's see. So this is it. I only got two because I wanted to make sure. Ooh, it's going to fit. Okay. I think I got too much, though. Too many things. You got to go. I don't even use that palette. Let's see. I got a bunch of some of this stuff is gonna have to be stacked. I gotta have a million and ten things, but I'm gonna just have to get another drawer for um this other little stuff because they're cheap. I think I only paid I don't know like six bucks. And if I would have went to the container store, this would have been probably like ten dollars. So I'm gonna put it in the drawer. Okay, y'all. So it actually really fit in there well 
And this way, when I'm opening the drawer, it's not like all over the place. Okay. And I still got room here. So if I wanted to put some things here, I can. That didn't fit in there until I get another drawer. These are all like little face and eye shimmers and stuff. I don't even know how. Not too many, only about four fit in there. Oh, you know what? Be smart. Put them this way. I'm going to get another container and move these um, eyeliners and all these other pencils somewhere else and then rearrange. But I love it. Open it and everything is in its place. So that's that. And then let's get into this perfume tray that I told y'all I was ordering and see. It's always like a hit or miss to me when you order on Amazon for like decorative stuff because people know how to make pictures look real good and then you get it and it's like people on Amazon that sell stuff, a lot of times you get the stuff and it's like this ain't what I ordered so we about to see. It's cute, so let's go ahead and put my little Coke perfume collection on it. And as you can see, the top is glass. And this is going to give me motivation every day to fill up and get some new perfume so i'm gonna do a whole video on um new perfume that i bought for you all so this is what i have so far this is it oh you know what i do have one more that my mom bought me that i always forget is here because i put it on the side it's by toby tobin I showed this in like one of my first vlogs ever because she bought me um, perfume and candles through this brand. And there, they sell this brand um, in Nordstrom's, I believe. So, and that matches the stand. So, yeah, again, I will leave this stand on um, in the description box. I don't think it was that expensive. I know it was under 40 bucks. But yes, it's so cute. Classy. So that was all I got from Amazon for the moment. Uh, Amazon is just so addicting. Like, there's so many good finds. And to me, you can find so many good items rather than going in these expensive stores. So I'm starting to really, really like Amazon as far as like home decor. You just have to really read the reviews to make sure that you ain't buying no crap. Um, before we get into the PR packaging, I want to show you all these in Bottega, Bottega Veneta inspired heels that um, I don't even know how I found these, but they were on Shein. They're on Shein and they have different colors, but tell me these are not freaking cute. Like I'm in love with this style. Look, and they don't have the little patches on the bottom like Bodega, but I wasn't expecting them. And then, um, of course, the their straps that strap up your leg, and the heel is not too high for my girls like me that do not like to be in no high heels. But look, this is so cute for the summer. You can pair this with jeans with a dress, anything basically, but these will be getting their wear out. 
this summer and I got these in a size 42 yes these are really really cute really 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 cute so I have been getting a lot of um PR stuff like different companies that want to work with me and I noticed that um, a few of them were like directly from China and I was a little skeptical because this one company that um, reached out to reached out to me and wanted to send me some jewelry I didn't really see them like have any interaction with a lot of like other influencers and it just seemed shady, but they didn't ask me for no money or anything. I asked them, well, is there a promo code I could give, um, you know, my subscribers or my follower followers on Instagram? And they were just like, no, just post the jewelry on your Instagram and tag us. So I'm like, what's going on? Anyway, I did get the jewelry. It's by a company called EEKE. -E. And the jewelry is very nice, very fashion forward, very like what's in right now. But I'm like, let's see how this jewelry is going to look because it was a little random to me. But again, I am thankful for my blessings. Um, but let's see how this jewelry looks. And I was able to pick out like three or four different pieces. Okay. So this is the first box and this is the company EEKE -E -E. and wow look y'all it comes in a nice drawstring bag oh wow I take that back I'm sorry and then they gave me this little bag oh wow so this is the bag it came with a little cute little shopping bag and then it even came with a cloth to clean the jewelry i guess don't ever underestimate do not underestimate just go with the flow yep so anyway these are the pieces that i picked out Wow, you can tell that this is really, really like made well. So it's this pearl set and it has this purple diamond on it, focus. And they even have the diamond wrapped, the stone, I should say, wrapped. Wow. And then it has this chain detail at the end. So that's going to be really, really cute. And then... The second item, if I can open it, I'm shook. I really thought that it was about to be on some bull. That's what I get for trying to knock my blessings. So the next thing is this chain. It's a link chain. Then it has a diamond um, chain on there as well as pearls. And how does this go? Oh, wow. And then look, the clamp. To attach it oh shit I gotta figure out how to open this I ain't gonna do this on camera but as you can see the clamp um, has a diamond detail on it yes this is really really pretty and you could probably either wear it this way or if you want to wear it this way with the pearls going to the back there's so many ways that I could style this I'm going to have to give them a real cute picture for this. A real cute picture. I'm already envisioning what I'm going to do. And then, last but not least, this is my favorite item that I think... Oh, they gave me some... I'm about to cry, y'all. They gave me, like, way more... Oh, no, I'm tripping. I ordered this. <laughs> I don't forgot what I ordered from these people. Okay, so the next thing are these earrings. I just want to, I don't want to break nothing. Wow, this is some nice jewelry. So, um, the next pair, next thing is these pair of earrings here. 
and I've really been feeling this style where you have like one dangle earring and then one um, shorter earring. And, ooh, it's getting hot. Let me cut on the light, y'all, because it's getting dark. Okay. Wow, this is some nice jewelry. I'm not even capping right now. So it came with, um, hold on. Hold on. So it came with a dangle earring and then a star shorter earring. Yes, wear your hair up, girl, in a high bun or something. And as you can see, this is just very good quality. Like everything is sparkling, focus camera. Look at that. Wow. So, you know, I'm going to definitely um, link them in the description box for sure. So you guys can check out their website. And I noticed that they're, um, they are launching some new jewelry for the... I don't know if they said it's their summer line or what, but they have some really cute stuff. And then another thing that I ordered was this Taurus. They have like the signs, the different um, astrology signs. So I'm a Taurus, if you didn't know. And so I got this necklace and then this Taurus pendant. Oh my God, y'all, this is not going to focus, but it is so cute. It has the Taurus sign on it, and then it has like all the signs going around it, and then like a little tiny diamond where the Taurus sign is supposed to go, and it's stamped on the back with the Taurus sign. So I'll probably wear this every day, and let's just get into this chain. Let's get into this chain. Focus. Focus. Oh my God, my camera's on one today. This is really, really nice. Thank you, EEKE. -E. But one more thing, my favorite thing that I, oh, dang it, I ordered the wrong one though. I wanted the circular diamonds. And this is the square ones, but this is still pretty. So I ordered this diamond bracelet and then it has a little cl clamp clasp on the end but bruh look at this icy look at that whoa Thank you, thank you so much, EEKE, -E -E, for sending this stuff. I'm going to put the link at the bottom. I'm just, I'm shook because I was, I'm sorry. Like, I was kind of like, they don't have a promo code. They just want me to post and tag them on their Instagram. But I'm like, wow, all this stuff is like very, very nice. So anyway, y'all, I'm going to leave, um, the link to their website in the description box and i'm gonna go ahead and close out this vlog um ooh, it's hot that's why the ac is not on because we had the guys here doing those speakers anyway um if you're new here go ahead and hit that subscribe button what you waiting for hope you all enjoyed this vlog and as always go ahead and make sure that you like and comment below and i will see y'all in the next one peace